What is up, everybody? Welcome to my iOS app reviews. We are on the iPad today because I'm filming with my iPhone. <clears throat> but primarily, I use this on my iPhone, this app. And, um, wow, pretty cool. Um, this is the biggest, newest trending app. You probably heard about it. Everybody's talking about it. Um, everybody's talking about it. Um, it's going viral. I'm a big lover of these types of apps, as you can see, being a photographer, and I just love these filter apps. This is the Face app. This is the one that is known to age you. Everybody's putting them up on Facebook, Twitter. Pretty neat. That's the icon right there. This is meant for an iPhone, so I have to double enlarge this. Um, this is the tutorial here. I just installed this on my iPad because, again, I'm running it on my iPhone. And you can actually import photos that are already taken. And it's pretty neat. And as you can see, see these are from, coming from my iCloud to my iPhone. So I can actually show you. Uh, but this is the app. You basically can import your photos that you're already taken. You can apply the filters. There's an old filter. There's a young filter. Or you can take a picture right in the app. You can also add backgrounds. Now, it's really nice. It's got some sophisticated algorithms. And, you know, you can actually put your own filters, vignettes, backgrounds. And it's actually really neat. Now, let me see if I can actually access my photo gallery here because I have my iCloud synced. Like, see, these are the originals. So I took this one, beautiful, handsome man, and then there's the, see, face app. There's the old version of me, still sexy as ever. And there's the young version. I look like Ricky Martin. And then you keep going. I did another one. There's the old version. I did my mother. Let's just say she wasn't too happy about that. But what's neat is that you could do the brick background. My father. Hey, what do you want from me? Look at that. Looks like Ernest Borgnine. Horrible. My mother again. Turned, turned my mother into my grandmother. My father again. We did the reverse effect on him. Looked like maybe he could be my brother. My uncle. And reverse effect on him. Which almost looks like me. You can tell we're related. But, I mean, pretty damn neat. You know... That is the Facebook, or the Face app. You could also share. Um, you could also put it on Twitter. You could also put it on Instagram, Facebook. But I think this is pretty neat. It, it, I can understand the hype. It is pretty cool. You know, I always like messing around with these um, these photo apps. Let's see here. All right, I'm actually gonna do this. Let's see. All right, I just took a picture of myself, so I'm gonna hit the use button. It says processing. And there's the original. Now these are the options you get. Now listen, some are pro, but I stick to the free ones. This is the most popular one right there. It's the old the old option. Sometimes it takes a while. Now naturally, I'm doing a live demo, so it's gonna fuck up, That naturally. It has to, because that's just the way it is. So, it has to mess up, because I'm doing, like I said, a live demo. So we're gonna go back in, use that picture again. And look at that, wow. Ooh, that might be the creepiest one yet. 
Jesus. Ugh. See, it's weird. It just it makes me look like a totally different person. It's very strange. Um, and then once you apply it, then you can add whatever you want to add. Um, there's backgrounds. There are filters. What's nice is you can add like this bokeh effect. And it instantly adds it. It's pretty neat how it does it. There's a brick. And it's all instant. There's no editing. There's no photo editing. It's a click of a button. Touch of a button. Pretty neat. I think this app is pretty cool. I can understand, like I said, the hype. It is a neat app. And that is the face app. You can have a lot of fun. I can see this being a big hit at parties, you know, pranking people. And that is my review and how the app works. Go check it out. It is free. There are functions that are paid for. But for the most part, the main, you know, functions are free. You can tweak things too. Take care, everybody. Until the next iOS app review. I will see you guys again very soon. Take care.